Hello, this is A.G. Bailey, and welcome to a special preview episode of my next LP. You might know the developer better for the Disgaea series, but this was before that, with Rhapsody, a musical adventure. For this LP, I have decided to primarily use the DS version of the game. However, I'd also like to insert some clips of the PS1 version, so anyone playing along with the LP can follow with either version of the game. Kind of like how I did with the Dragon Quest IV or Lunar 1 LPs, but more relevant there. And if you hang out in the title screen long enough, we'll get the first musical number of the game, so let's listen in. So, as you can tell, the, the voice acting was only subbed in the DS version. However, it was dubbed to English in the PS1 version. So let's check that one out. Now, in both games, the storyline progression, most of the dungeons, and most of the treasure locations are identical. Uh, one thing I wanted to show you guys are the differences in the songs between the two versions of the games. However, there are some other changes between the two versions regarding the battle mechanics. In this version, the battles are more like Disgaea, with being able to move around the battlefield like any strategy RPG. But in this case, the battlefields are so much smaller that it's kind of hard to take advantage of it, so that doesn't really add anything significant to the strategy, to me. Also, you can recruit monsters as party members, and I'll try to point out some of the better ones to get, but most of them are either not very good, or they take 
forever to find and ultimately recruit them. So let's listen to the English version of the intro song there. So, you might have noticed the way they pronounce cornet. I will do my best to use that official pronunciation, but chances are every now and then I'll forget about that and accidentally mispronounce it cornet, like in Radiant Historia, perfect chronology. And another unique aspect to the PS1 version are the difficulty modes. To my knowledge, I think they don't actually make anything more difficult, not even anything small, like increasing enemy stats, or giving them new abilities, or more complex AI scripts. No, nah, no. Nah. All it does is increase the amount of experience and money you win from battles. So, using hard mode as the baseline, normal mode rewards double the experience and money you win from battles, and easy mode rewards triple. That's all. In the DS version, there are no difficulty modes, but they reward experience based on the hard difficulty of the PS1 version and reward a little bit more money than that, too. So let me know what you think about the different language options for the songs in the LP. Personally, I think I'd like to use the English dubbed lyrics and just edit them into the LP of the DS version. But if enough of you guys strongly prefer the Japanese voice acting, well, I could reconsider that. This is H.G. Bailey, 
signing off. Have a good day.